Good afternoon, children. I'm so excited to see you. I have been looking at requests that some of you have sent me, and today we're going to read a book that Hayden has requested. Hayden wanted a book with sloths. So I went out and I found a book with sloths in it. It's called The Sloth Who Slowed Us Down. So look at the cover. What do you think this book is going to be about besides a sloth? It says the sloth who slowed us down. So what do you think this book will be about? A sloth, yeah, but what else? Let's see if we can figure it out. The Sloth Who Slowed Us Down by Margaret Wilde and illustrated by Vivian Tu. So if it was illustrated by somebody, what did they do for the book? Do you remember? And if it says it's by somebody, are they the author or the illustrator? Hmm. Here we go. Amy's family was the speediest family in the world. What does it look like they're doing? Kind of look like they're rushing around. Where are they going? Let's find out. They walked fast, drove fast, shopped fast, and ate fast. There was never any time to talk or play or laugh. Or lays. What's it mean to be lays or be do something that's lays? What do you what does that sound like? Lays. Yeah, it kind of sounds like lazy, doesn't it? So if you're lays, what do you think that you are? What do you think? Until the afternoon, Amy brought a sloth home to stay. Where on earth did you find him? Dad asked. Hanging from a tree in the park, Amy said plucking one beetle and two moths from his fur. Mom shuddered. He needs a bath, she said. Does he look dirty? Kind of does. Look right here on his head. So what's the name of this character? What's her name? And what did she just do? Let's find out what happens. Sloth shook his head very, very slowly because sloths do everything slowly. Right away, Mom said. So what does she want Amy to do? What does mom want Amy to do? What do you think? Sloth had a long leisurely bath with lots of bubbles, a purple duck, and a red boat. See his purple duck and his red boat? Is he in a hurry? No, because sloths are never in a hurry, but her family is. So what do you think is going to happen? He dried himself slowly, combed his fur slowly. <laughs> Look at that. Look how silly he looks. Admired himself for ages in the mirror and then crawled down the stairs for dinner. What do you think it means that he looked at himself in the mirror for ages? How long do you think that would be? A long time or a short time? Amy, Mom, and Dad were already sitting at the table. Hurry up, buddy, said Dan. Chop, chop said mom. See what I mean, sloth? Amy said with a sigh. So what are mom and dad still doing? Are they still in a hurry? Is that going to work for Mr. Sloth? Sloth ate very, very slowly. Look how slow he is and look, they're already done working on other things. He was so slow that Amy had plenty of time to talk about the things that had happened that day. So it looked like she did. So it looks like she's doing here. Yeah, what about here? And here? It looks like she won a trophy. Good job, Amy. How amazing, said Mom. I wish I had been there, said Dad. So what do you think the Mom and Dad are starting to realize? What do you think? The picture. When Sloth had finished helping very slowly to do the dishes, Dad said, there's just enough time for a quick trot around the block before bedtime. He still wants to go kind of quickly, doesn't he? Do you think it's going to happen fast? What do you think? But Sloth couldn't trot. He dragged himself along. Look how slow he's moving. Very, very slowly. Does it look like mom and dad are waiting? What do you think they're doing? 
Looks like they're going ahead. Yes, it does. So slowly that Amy and Mom and Dad had plenty of time to chat with the neighbors, pet a cat, throw a stick for a friendly dog, chatting, petting, and throwing a stick, admire the moon, and try to find the red star. Can you see the star? Can you see it? I think I see it. When they got home, Sloth made himself comfortable hanging from a tree in the garden. Amy hugged him goodnight. Thank you, she whispered. This has been the best day of my life. Why do you think Amy has had such a good day with the Sloth? What do you think? What have her parents been doing, finally? Look, here they are again. This must be the next day. Sloth stayed for three glorious weeks. Three weeks. There are seven days in a week. So how many days are they, is the sloth staying? What's seven plus seven plus seven? Hmm. But one morning, Sloth moved next door to the new speediest family in the world. Why do you think Sloth moved next door to the new speedy family? Why do you think? What did Sloth help the family do? I'll miss him, Dad said. He's such a restful little fellow. He'll hate it there, Mom said. That family's always in such a rush. They walk fast, drive fast, shop fast, and eat fast. Oh, Sloth will change all that, Amy said. So how does Amy know that the sloth is going to change that? What did Amy's family do that they're saying the other family did? Right. Eat fast, shop fast, drive fast. Exactly. And he did very, very slowly. So did he change how that family is going to be too, do you think? I hope so. I hope everybody slows down and starts to enjoy things, just like the sloth taught us. So, who was the main character in the story? What's her name? Right, it's Amy. And what did he do? Talk to the people you're sitting with. See if you can figure it out. Explain who the characters are. Explain what they did. Thank you again for tuning in. See you guys tomorrow. Bye!